Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to talk about panty lines because I don't know about you, but I I hate panty lines. Scratch that. I loathe panty lines. So today we are going to talk about panties, panty lines, and camel toes. They are or their lack of it, whatever. So for starters, we are going to talk about um, people who wear uh, white pants or any bright colored bottom, like um, a dress, a skirt, uh, pants, or what do you call them? Leggings. Any bright colored uh, bottom or a dress with white pants or bright colored pants. I mean, what's wrong with you? I've seen so many ladies with um, someone is wearing a white, a white dress or a yellow dress and they are wearing a red a red panty or um which other color is quite shorty a red panty or an orange one and you're like lady did you check yourself out in the mirror before you left the house or was there no one in that house to tell you hey your dress and your panties are not they're not, they're not going together you know I've also seen someone, a lady, at church um, with a white dress, a white panty, and you can see where her, you can see her panties, you can see her, you know, you can see where the shape of her bum, and, oh, I don't know, I just, I just hate, I love the panty lines. So today we are going to talk about, I've already said that, um, yeah, so if you're wearing anything bright colored, you should wear red, uh, you should wear black panties or dark, dark pink, uh, sorry, dark purple or maroon, just the other day, so maroon panties and i was like hmm, i've never seen such a color you know maroon panties i've never seen that so it was really um it was mesmerizing yeah so if you're wearing something bright colored uh bright pan uh bright skirt or bright uh pants or skirt or dress Ensure you wear a, a dark colored panty or just black. Uh, yeah, nobody wants to see the shape of your bam. Anyway, uh, the second one is what? Um, the second one is panty lines. I have quite a number of panties. <laughs> Sorry, I'm manifesting my bra. I know. Um, yeah, so I have uh, five kinds of panties um, that you should or should not wear when you're wearing some of these things because, as I said, panty lines are not cute. I don't know about you, Benny. No. So, I have this one. I want this one. I've worn it once and it's clean so yeah <laughs> I don't know why I feel I should say that so this one I don't know oh yeah you can clearly see these these um do you call them hems or what you can see this line over here so when you wear this one it's it's uh, with a very tight dress 
like bandage dress or just something that's uh, quite tight on your bum it's it's definitely going to show the only um, the only good thing about it is that you can see you can see it's quite uh, it's quite stretchy so when you wear it it's going to come up to somewhere here so you're very sure it's going to hold your it's going to hold your tummy quite nicely the only downside to it is that it's going to show on you on your bum line and it's it's this hem over here it's as in it's very it's very nicely does that make sense? It 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 um it holds your bum nicely, holds your tummy nicely. Um, definitely. I don't know about you people, but um, uh, if you have quite a kitambi or um, what do you call kitambi in English? Um, bit of a pot belly. So when you wear a panty, it's definitely going to show where it's reaching like somewhere here wherever you your panty your your waist goes up to it's definitely going to show but with this one it's it's going to leave your tummy um, smooth and nicely shaped so if you can find such a panty with um with this part this part this part without this part this hem you're good to go I I also bought this one it's almost the same it's almost the same uh, shape the same concept but it's got I haven't worn this one so I definitely cannot give um a very concise review because i haven't wanted to know whether this this part is showing but i'm hoping it doesn't show so yeah when you wear this one it also has this uh part it's the same concept as this one but this one is not as it's not as it's not as is it tall or long <laughs> so yeah so when you wear this one i am hoping it's not going to oh yeah it's i'm hoping it's not going to show the party line so i hope when i wear it it's not going to be um disappointing because it cost me 200 yeah this one and this one i bought them at 200 each uh i was hoping i could get a black one because the the dress i had in mind when i was buying this one turns out it's they're both bright colored so it's not going to work uh -huh. this one this one is a this one is lacy it's it's got a lot of lace going on so as you can see here when you wear it it's definitely not going to show because it's it's quite um it's quite light it's not going to you know it's not going to chora on your bum <laughs> i hope um it's not going to show on your bum when you wear tight pants or tie a tight dress but the the downside is that this the waist part it's definitely going to show so if you are a person who wears corsets or body shapers you're good to go with this one if you are not you definitely need to get one or not depending so this one and this one same was up group but at least this one can be worn with a lot of clothes because it's black. 
and this lacy part is also not going to show on your clothes so yeah and this one also i'm hoping th this one has a very interesting waist it's um i'm hoping when i wear it it's not going to show because um the waist is not as it's not as um it's not as conspicuous as this one oh my goodness it's not uh, focusing so this one is not as it's not as conspicuous as this one it's like uh i don't know how to explain it but it's like the same material with it's like the waist is just the same material with um the panty and the hem part of it is also not showing so yeah the other thing i learned is that if you are wearing something bright colored like any bright colored panty up uh, pants um like white any bright colored uh and the panties in your closet are going to show anyway whether you whether you wear any of whether you wear this one or whether you wear this one or you wear black it's going to show anyway as in it's not really the color but it's going to show panty lines and we are trying not to have panty lines so i learned you can you can use your your stockings as um as andies you can either cut it after here so that it can become like shorts boy shorts or whatever or you can cut it over here you know to make it like um to make it like um another leggings or pants so that you can wear it uh inside and then you can put on your you can put on your pants or yeah pants mostly but you can also cut it uh to wear it with your dress but make sure it's the make sure it's the really the really light ones these ones are quite heavy so when you cut them i have a feeling they are going to roll up and um you know and show on your clothes and that is what we are trying to avoid the third thing is ensure you buy um underwear that underwear that fits you it's not too tight it's not too loose because when it's too loose when you wear whatever you're wearing um this side um okay the back side the back side this part will definitely roll up when we when you wear your whatever you're wearing and it's going to show or if you can't avoid it you know when sometimes you buy panties and after some time they start stretching and you don't want to throw them away so once you wear you wear your panties and you can see or you can feel they have rolled up ensure you um especially it's uh, when you're wearing pants it's better it's better to uh put your hand inside your bam and and um and straighten it i don't know about dresses because i i don't i don't wear dresses a lot of times and the number of dresses that i have are almost black or dark colored uh what else um aha camel toes sometimes oh 
ya we ya ensure you buy um you buy i've said ensure you buy nicely fitting panties it shouldn't be too tight or too loose so when it's too tight it's it's going to cut you where the panty line goes it's going to cut your bum into half so i don't know i think uh, i think i would rather the one that's um that's showing than the one that cuts your bum into half i really hate that anyway about camel toes um some people cannot help it because of their of whatever clothes they're wearing either that especially gym clothes or when someone is wearing tights or um jeggings that are too tight it's definitely going to show no matter how no matter how hard you try not to to show it so you can use um panty line panty liners um and when you're putting it in you should uh, not the, the the same way we put it like this when we are putting it for periods and discharges you ensure you put it this way across uh, let me show you with the black one it's easier to show so instead of putting it this way ensure you put it this way ensure you put it this way to you know hide your your camel toes and yeah i i think that's it about panty lines and camel toes and all that good job so i hope you've learned something and i hope i've not forgotten anything that was important to say uh yeah i hope you've learned something and you're going to incorporate it into your daily uh into daily life so don't forget to subscribe to share comment and tell a friend to tell a friend bye